Now we have a domain name, we have web hosting and an SSL certificate on our website. And this is so far so good. Anyway, now let's first head over here to our appearance and themes and we are going to first install the theme that we are going to be using in our website creation process. And in this case, we come over here to themes and we add a new theme. And then I'll search for the theme I want. The theme is called Cadence. And that's the theme we are going to be using to build up our website. I'll simply say install. And I'll activate my theme. Disable all these notifications over here just to have a clean dashboard. Then what I'm going to do is to delete these other themes because we don't need them. And they as well bring an extra load to our server as we are browsing our website. So I'll just delete this as well by clicking on the theme and you get this delete option down below there. Now I'll head over here to plugins, install plugins. And as you already know that we are using the managed version of WordPress by hosting a that means that it will come with already pre-installed plugins that work pretty well with a hosting a web hosting platform. And in my case, I will delete the plugins that I think I will not need in this tutorial. So we only use the plugins. So we only have the plugins that will be needed on our website. So in this case, I'll delete this. I'll delete this as well. And this one, uh, I'll leave Lightspeed Cache. I will delete Optin Monster and WP Forms. So I'll just click over here, deactivate. Then I'm going to select all of them apart from this. Then I'll delete those other plugins. Right, so we have only one plugin remaining, which is a caching plugin. The next what we are going to do is to add the two other plugins that we will need for our website. Actually, three plugins, that is Elementor and the Contact Form plugin, and also the other add-on for Elementor called the premium add-ons for Elementor. So by coming over here to plugins, I'll search for Elementor. I'll install Elementor. Elementor is a page building software that will enable us to create all the sections of our website and we will have all the power to customize each and every section, including the responsive settings of, of our WordPress website. Currently, Elementor is the leading WordPress page builder and has a lot of contributors including third-party add-ons that bring a lot of power as well to the Elementor page builder itself. Then the other plugin we'll need is called the Premium Add-ons for Elementor. It already shows up over here, but just in case it doesn't show up for you, just simply search for Premium Add-ons. And here you go, simply install. So the Premium Add-ons for Elementor is an extension for the Elementor page builder that actually creates third-party widgets or add-ons for the Elementor page builder. And this actually enables you power up so many other things for your WordPress website. I'll be showing you in a while how the premium add-ons for Elementor comes in handy as you're using Elementor page builder. It's now already installed. What I'll do now is to install the contact form plugin or the contact form 7 plugin that we will be using to collect emails off our WordPress website. So I'll simply install and now when I head back to plugins, I have all of them installed over here. So I'll activate the Elementor page builder because that is what I need currently. And voila. So see you in the next section.